Hi everyone! In this video I want to show you how you can easily connect Facebook leads to Telegram without any coding. I'll show you the case for automatically receiving message to your Telegram each time you get a new lead in Facebook ads, but there are lots of other variants. In this guide you'll see how it works and then you can configure the integration according to your needs. I'll do it with the help of the Abbeyway. First you need to sign up. After you've done this, go to the tab My Apps and add Facebook and Telegram. Then you need to connect them. Let's start with Facebook. When you click on this button, you need to authorize your account. It's important that this user should have access to Facebook Ads Manager page in which the lead form is done. When you see this green text, Facebook is successfully connected. Next, let's connect Telegram. But before doing it, we need to take several steps. Our task is to create a bot. To do this, I use Botfather. Click Start. After that, New Bot. Input the name for your bot and next its username. It must have the bot ending. And you'll get message with this token. Copy it. Now we can connect this bot to Abbeyway. Click Connect and paste the token here. Now both apps are connected and we can start to configure the integration. I've created a lead form in advance. I hope you already know how to do it. If not, you can easily find such a video on YouTube. There are plenty of them. And now we should create a way. You can see this button on the top of the page. Click it and let's start. You can give it the name which you need. For example, Facebook and Telegram. Next, you should specify the trigger. Here choose Facebook lead forms. Now the new lead will be the trigger for the action. Next, choose the page and lead form from the list of ones that you have. Now we need to find Facebook lead form testing tool. It's a standard Facebook tool. Go to this page and in the first sentence there's a link on the tool itself. Click it. This tool simulates the lead in order to check that everything works. I choose this page and this form and click the button Create Lead. And the tool will send me a testing lead. After that, return to Appyway and click Update Available Fields. The data has appeared. You can create different questions in your lead form and everything you need will be here. Now let's continue with the action. Choose a service here. In our case, it's Telegram. And here you can see lots of variants of action. Let's choose Send Text Message or Apply. After that, test the connection and update available fields again. Next, we need to input here Chat ID, so we return on Telegram. Bot that I created can send messages directly, only to a group, so we need to create it. Click New Group, choose a name and add here your bot. Pay attention that the group must be public. So, go to the group settings and in the group type section change the type and choose the chat link that is suitable for you. Now copy the text after the slash and save changes. The part you've copied is the chat ID. Now we can paste it to the field on Appyway. Pay attention to the format. You can do exactly this way, or integration won't work. Now type the text of the message, for example, you got a new lead. And below let's add name, email and phone from the Facebook lead form. Then click Test and Activate. If you want to add it this way, you can find it in the tab My Ways, deactivate it and change everything you need. But don't forget to activate it again. Now you should create test lead one more time. 
first delete it and then create it again. Please keep in mind that transmission of the data may take a little time. Sometimes it comes immediately, sometimes you have to wait for a while. The time of waiting is up to 15 minutes. Now I'll go to my Telegram group and you can see that I've already received the message from the bot. Name, email, phone number. The integration is working. Using Epiway you can make integration and automate your work. If you have any problem or questions, please ask for help in our community. And of course, don't forget to look through the categories, choose appropriate software for you and improve your business process.